If you have felt overwhelmed by the AI right now, you are not alone. Every single day, a thousand new tools launch, and let's be honest, 99% of them are shiny distraction. But I have spent the last year filtering through the noise to find the top 1% that actually matters. These aren't just toys, they are the infrastructure of every new business. And I have built the perfect test check and broken it down into four categories creation, growth, productivity and operation. So without wasting any more time, let's get into it. And we start with the content factory and especially the footage. The bottleneck used to be finding good short video, but now I can just generate it using Kling 2.6. I can simply type a prompt like cinematic drone shot and it generate high resolution video that understand physics and lightning perfectly. It effectively puts a film crew inside my laptop Plus, I can upload a static image of a product and Kling will animate it into a video instantly. It is the fastest way to get the asset that doesn't look generic. And now, to edit that footage, our next tool will help us in it. And that is Descript. I use Descript because it stops me from wasting hours and hours on a timeline. It just transcripts the video so I can edit it just like the Word document. If I want to cut a bad tick, I simply highlight the text, hit delete and the video cuts itself. But the real lifesaver is the studio sound. I can record on my iPhone in a messy room, toggle this mode on and it remove the echo to make me sound like I am in a pro studio. And now, if you are talking about audio, 11 Lab is the only choice because it captures the nuances of human speech. It understands breaths and pauses better than anyone else. I use this to patch my video. If I misspoke a line, I just type the correction and it generates the audio in my clone voice perfectly. I also use their dubbing feature which translates my content into a Spanish or German while keeping my exact voice tone, instantly doubling my potential audience. Finally, pixels for thumbnail because you can make a masterpiece video but if nobody clicks it, it's dead. It generates high quality thumbnail based on what it's trending on YouTube right now. But the killer feature is the predictive score. It analyzes the image and gives me a predicted click through rate CTR, before I upload my video, turning the art of getting clicks into signs. Next is the distribution machine. To write the copy, I don't use ChatGPT. I use Jasper because it is built specially for marketing performance. The difference is brand voice. I fed it my old content and it learned my tone. Now, whether it's writing a series email or a tweet, it actually sounds like me, not a robot. I can give it one blog post and it instantly remakes it into a LinkedIn post, a Twitter thread and a newsletter, turning one asset into five. Writing is easy, but strategy is hard. And that is where Get Poppy comes in. It solves the blank page problem by mapping out our entire week of content. I give it one core topic like AI automation and it acts as a strategist, suggesting a contrarian post for Monday like how to create this for Wednesday and a meme for Friday. It keeps my content calendar full so I never have to wake up and wonder what to post today. For designing, Kanga Magic Studio has completely replaced my need for junior designer. I just use Magic Expand constantly. If a photo is wrong size for Instagram, the AI paints in the missing edges perfectly. And the Magic Grab feature lets me pick people out of our flat photos and move them around like a sticker, making complex Photoshop tasks easy enough to do in 5 seconds. And to capture the lead, I use ManyChat because it's removed the fraction between I like this to I bought this. And we have seen the posts that say comment links. That's ManyChat working behind the scene. When you comment, it instantly DMs you the resource. And to be honest, the open rates on these DMs are insane, over 80%, allowing me to run a 24 7 series machine that captures leads while I'm just sleeping. Now, let's talk about the productivity stack. My inbox used to be disaster until Superhuman fixed it. It's the fastest email experience on earth. Between the AI sorting, which separates VIPs from newsletter, and the keyword shortcut, I can fly through 50 emails in 5 minutes. It gamifies the inbox, so I hit inbox zero every single day, which saves me huge amount of mental energy. For everything else, my life lives in Notion because it is my second dream. I use the AI feature to clean up my chaos. I dump messy brain dumps all meeting notes into a page, click summarize and it turns them into a clean actionable to-do list instantly. It keeps my project, my content and my goal all in one organized workspace. 
and the next will help us digital glue all of them together which is zapier it helps us hold all these tools together by connecting apps that doesn't usually talk for example if i get a new lead in gmail zapier automatically send it to slack and add it to notion i build the pipeline once and it automates the busy work forever it's like having a digital intern and now for meeting i hate those awkward ai bots that join the call so i use granola instead it run natively on my desktop i jot down rough bullet points during the calls and afterward granola uses the context to clean them up into a perfectly formatted summary email it's like no taking without the bot and finally the operations track we need a record of truth for every meeting and in this firefly.ai help us it records and transcribes everything the magic isn't the recording it's the search i can search my voice conversation just like google doc if i need to remember what we agreed on regarding the budget i can just type budget and it plays the exact clip so i never lose the data and to keep the communication professional i rely totally on grammarly it's not just a spell checker it's a brand protection because it monitors my tone to ensure i sound confident and polite whether it's a slack message or a contract it stops me from sending something i might regret later and finally to manage the money and the customer the hubspot is the top notch and the hubspot new ai feature automates the boring data entry by tracking emails and updating the deal stages automatically it ensures i have a clear view of my sales pipeline without spending my friday updating spreadsheets and finally the heavy hitter chat gpt i use this for everything the other tools cannot do i use it for heavy lifting like coding logic problem and drafting scripts but i also use the vision feature constantly i snap a photo of a whiteboard diagram and it turns my scribble into a structured digital table it is the ultimate generalist assistant finally building a tech stack isn't about holding software it's about buying back your time we just covered 16 tools that can completely overhaul your all workflow and i have listed every single one of them in the description below so you can explore them at your own pace don't just watch this video pick one tool test it out and start automating your busy work today and if you like this video hit like subscribe and tell me in the comment section which tool you are going to work first this is nit making learning easier and fun thanks for watching